Aww. He's <laughs> chilling down there. All right, Skylar versus Dio. Like, Dio's probably going to get... Probably get messed up because like Ubi out of shield is so good against Rob or any character in general. But like Ubi got uh, Ubi out of shield against Rob. <laughs> so <laughs> see, look at this. He get three percent. Oh, he messed up the second there, but he gets three percent on Rob because he's a he's a big big body, pretty heavy, yeah. free combos. I definitely feel like uh, Game and Watch is one of those underrated characters in this game because just. Like that Nair alone is actually pretty uh, yeah. busted. Like it leads into itself, and then you can get like follow-ups off of it. And it's pretty hard to like parry and stuff. And it's so hard. like if you shield it, kind of like just have to shield it. Yeah, you can't do much out of it. I'm trying to beat it out too, it's kind of hard too. Oh, he's probably dead. Yeah, Skylar gonna go off stage. Rob really can't do much there. Like the best he could do is probably attack and not be out of way. Uh, like up your way. And Dio got the kill right back. Dio's not doing too bad. Does Dio normally not do too well against Skyler? I mean, I really don't watch the match, but I assume like it's hard because like Skyler's really good at juggling. Like, and then like oh, yeah. Bob is just a big character. I felt that in bracket today. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, like Season so keep juggling, keep juggling. Probably gonna go for an air dodge right here. Yeah, that up air is like surprisingly uh, pretty busted because. If you try to contest it with like a hitbox, it goes through the hitbox. It's intangible, so ah. it just hits you anyways. So you have to go for an air dodge if you want to get out of it. Mm -hmm. And Skylar is so good at like sharking your your. Uh... What's up? Why? <laughs> Devin's free. I know. <laughs> It's crazy. I brought Potter. I brought Potter and Devin here. I had to fight Potter, and if I beat Potter, I would have fought Devin. And then, but then they had to fight, so it's just a carpool fight. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on 150. Oh, it's down tilt, dude. The down tilt's the wave. Game Watch Ooh. has a lot of kill power in this game. Like oh, his yeah. chair and down tilt, like kill surprisingly early. Look at these juggles. Yeah. Especially since uh, Rob has a big base, yeah. it's just like combo food because you just have to aim for his legs. And then know? if you notice, like you know how like Rob's nares, it's not um, that's pretty good. Nares, uh, so you know Rob's nares really good. Uh -huh. um, Skylar doesn't really have to like worry about it. He can up air it because you know his upper is not even touching his body. Exactly. So he, he's, like, he can just straight up do it. Yeah. Pretty safe way to do I it. I do think that um, oh bucket also shuts down the gyro. Does it? Yeah. Oh yeah, because that's like a multi-hit and it just like straight up soft. Um hit. the bucket actually reflects physical projectiles. Yeah. Which I think is ridiculous. I see if he used it. Yeah, he did it right there. Oh No, I think that's ridiculous. That's that's actual trash. He could have went for like a, probably like a bucket back here. You know how he reflected that? He could have went for like a run up um, jump back here. Or rar back here. Probably. I would have probably killed on. I mean, I don't think it will kill, but he can get a free off stage gimmick. I think it's a reflector, so it'd make it stronger, too. So it might have killed. <laughs> yeah. On, did you say on stream? Off stream. Yeah, I was like, I was like, what are you talking about, dude? Oh, boy. Uh, Underdog, come commentate with me. Ah, lame. All right. Okay, so for Game & Watch, definitely he wants to go for back airs to condition his shield. And once he conditions his shield, he's going to be able to grab him. And Rob doesn't really have that many good out-of-shield options. So having him 
in the shielding position is also advantageous, not only for him to press his advantage, but to also um, pressure something something that Rob really can't help. At work or at best, what he can do is up smash out of shield, but nair, forward air, back air, all those are disjointed. So it makes it really hard for the Rob to get in. And Rob's primary neutral tool, which is Gyro and Nair, are punishable by two of Game Watch's options. So we have a Bucket for Gyro, and then uh, Up B out of Shield versus uh, Nair, especially if he parries it. Dio's recognizing that he's liking to recover low, so he's going for these uh, side Bs to try to stuff that out. Unfortunately, it does leave him in a bad spot, and uh, Game & Watch gets, gets back to stage for free if he waits. Game three. Or no, no, no. The Skyler's up 2 0. Okay, me starts fighter. I think in this matchup, it's probably not going to go well for me sword fighter. I would imagine that um, since most of me sword fighter's setups come off of projectiles and. Uh, Game & Watch has the bucket, nothing good will come out of it. But, Swordfighter does have like a nice size sword, so... I feel like in this one, uh, Skylar's probably gonna opt to be more aggressive, only because Swordfighter's frame data is not exactly like the best. Especially considering that neutral B has so much end lag. It's actually pretty ridiculous. Okay, that's... That actually evened it up pretty, pretty well. I think uh, Game & Watch here wants to go for a lot of disjoints because he's going to be having to contest the, the sword. Uh, as we saw there, like uh, Dio went for a forward smash. It got stuffed out by a grab because the forward smash actually isn't that fast. It might be like frame 25 or something. I'm probably wrong. So, it's really good to keep uh, Swordfighter in the air because, again, the up air is intangible, so it makes it to where he's going to have a hard time landing. He'll have to commit to either a side B or a reflector, depending on which sword me this is. And I think uh, Skylar can just sit and shield, honestly, against this character because, again, if up B out of shield and. Uh, me sword fighter not having any real follow ups and just makes it to where he can air dodge and just react to the option that the me sword fighter wants to go for. Yeah. Really good recognition by Dio to see that he. He needed to land and he wanted to center stage, so he just walled him out and then got off. Oh, <laughs> he dropped the jab lock, unfortunate. Um, recognizing that he wanted to land on stage, so he just went for a nice um, back air to deny the stage. Wow, that has a lot of end lag. Okay, so it can reflect it. Yeah, no, this is. This is 
gonna be a pretty uh, done deal. Cover him high. Ooh, nice. Unfortunately, the multi hits didn't connect, but he got the flirt to close it out anyway. 